Ooh, it's good to be back. Hello, Goosebumps fans. It's time to actually talk about a nice exclusive thing for you. Of course, we got Goosebumps news. So anyways, the interesting part has to be this, is that... Well, I haven't done it. I will get back on it. Hopefully by the end of January, we'll start with Goosebumps news yet again. But for right now, this has to be told right now. Which is, Goosebumps is going to get a new series. And a new series is none other than House of Shivers. And it's going to come out or start this debut on September 19th. Am I right? Yep, September 19th, 2023, a.k.a. Stanzi's birthday. Oh, wait, nope, Stan's birthday is October 19th, not September my bad. Well, anyways, yeah, so we got the first book that will happen, which is scariest book ever. And I had to f make sure I understand what's going to happen, folks, because we have a big doozy. Could this be just like Hall of Horrors and Most Wanted, where it went side by side with Horrorland? Or could this be the brand new title that we will use? We'll have we will read from for now on. Me, I kind of think that this would most likely be a side one. But how about we let people tell us for ourselves what do they think about this? Alright, so from my main what I have to say is this, is that I gave them a question, and thank you, phone, for being a complete no job moron. Yes, I definitely wanted you to restart, so I have to scroll back down. You idiot. Why are you so stupid? Okay, anyways. <clears throat> so what I said was, okay, so a new Goose Hunt series has been announced. Question, would you be okay with it being released alongside Slappy World? Would you be fine if... Slappy World ends and this new series takes its place. We had six votes on this one. We had at least five people saying that they are fine with this new series to be alongside Slappy World and they are fine with the new series taking Slappy World's place if it happens. And we have one person who definitely is like, I don't like this being at least alongside a Slappy World and they do not want Slappy World to end and take this series to take its place. So it looks like someone actually is like, yeah, I don't like the idea of this series i would prefer just keeping slappy world for a little bit more yeah i wonder how everyone else to think about that opinion it's like yeah i wonder what you guys have to think about that opinion anyways we're gonna go to this account which luckily for us you guys actually are very active and that is awesome thank you for being active okay so we have same exact question and this one's a good one because, man, eight people in total. So if I can understand correctly, five, five people yet again, who knows, maybe it's the five people for another one, they all agree that they would be fine or at least alongside of it, and it'll be fine if it takes Cyber World's place. We have one person who actually is fine with it being really sided, but they don't really want Slappy World to be taken away. <laughs> And other person is that he's not fine to release it. They're they're tired about this. They would really like to have a new series that isn't Slappy World, which is like, you know, duly noted. Do you really want to continue hearing Slappy actually make lots of comments? I was like, it didn't even cash in. I would have liked the other dummies to get their own book, and he just just insults them and criticizes them and say how much they suck. Except of course when Goldie or snappy is involved it's like yeah i'm shocked that snappy didn't get another book makes more sense that snappy gets a book i'm just saying it kind of makes sense if he's his beloved brother that means will it be he should actually had another book by now and of course the last person is the same where he believes that most likely from the same one it's most likely one for the other one he said no he won't be a good with the release alongside cyber world and no he doesn't want cyber world to be replaced so this was a good fight but of course as you can figure many people are tired of it and well many of people are okay with a new series and they're fine with just more stuff to read it's always good to have more content to read 
But of course, as you can see, there's still some who actually are debating about it. Good fight, though. But anyways, that's all that really needs to be mentioned. And if I'm going by Goosebumps Completionist, which I did the 10 books before this one, he apparently mentions that there might be monsters from the past that will make appearances to this series. So basically, it could actually end up being another Most Wanted. Which, are you okay with a new Most Wanted? <laughs> Would you prefer that he actually just brought back Most Wanted for round two? <laughs> he, I don't think he never do that before. It's like, yeah, it has to be in together, you know, both together. Yeah, he doesn't actually do that type of thing. So since he doesn't do that type of thing, are you fine with House of Shivers being the secret son of, uh, what was it? <laughs> Most Wanted. Yeah, the secret son of Most Wanted. Which, personally, I think it, as long as, you know, monsters being revisited and getting second chances and stuff, that'll be good. The only messed up part is that, like I said, when it comes to the books and the new TV show, they're basing it off of five books of their choosing that are very popular. So, that means all the books that have previously has been not re-released, they're not popular. So... That means that all the ones that they have released previously that have Brandon Dorman's freaking artwork on it, they're up for grabs. Anyone else? That's a no. It's like, let me try to remember. Yeah, they did have the gnomes. It's like, yeah, the Revenge of the, Pla Pla the, Revenge of the Law of Gnomes did show up. So I'm trying to figure out, is there an exception to it? But there isn't one. And also, can I actually just add one thing that I should have said in the 10 is that Don't Scream sounds like it could have actually have been like the cousin or the great cousin of Say Cheese and Die. I am shocked that it didn't continue on getting new sequels. Well, at least, you know, I mean, Say Cheese and Die actually just got sequel and then another sequel and then it got a third sequel. Finally, I don't know. We will just have to see what the future brings, but for now, this is all that I can tell you. House of Shivers, coming in September 19th of this year, and it will the bit first book will be Scariest Book Ever. No Slappy, no Slappy involved whatsoever, and I bet that most likely will give you a big breath of fresh air if you want one of the three or one that said something that they kind of want Slappy World to continue. How was Gary Day? Have a scary night.